When it comes to gaming performance, the GPU or graphics card is the most important component. If you want to achieve a higher number of FPS, then this is the first PC component you should be thinking about. That being said, if you want to play at 4K resolution smoothly, you need the right graphics card. 4K is the most demanding resolution. So trust me, it's very easy to get the wrong graphics card for 4K and your favorite game will feel stuttery. That's why I show you the best 4K graphics cards that you can buy right now in 2025 for every budget. The links to these graphics cards with the latest pricing and availability in your region will be down below in the video description. My name is Valentino, that being said, let's start. First, I will tell you which graphics cards to avoid buying when you want to buy a new GPU. And that's any RTX 4000 series graphics card from Nvidia in the brand new market. These graphics cards are not in production anymore, so the only way to get one is through the used market because if you try to buy them brand new, the price is insanely high. So do not buy any RTX 4000 series graphics card like the RTX 4070, 4080 and so on. Now let's go with the best graphics cards for 4K resolution and all of these GPUs are amazing for 1080p and 1440p resolution. So if right now you have a 1080p or 1440p monitor and you want to upgrade down the line to 4K resolution, well, all of these are going to be way more than enough. With the first GPU, we have the cheapest 4K graphics card in the RTX 5070. By the time of filming, this graphics card goes for 550 bucks. Now, for most people, this graphics card wouldn't be really good value if prices were normal in this market. But as of right now, since every graphics card is overpriced, the 5070 is the only one selling at its MSRP of 550 bucks. This GPU will allow you to play games at 4K 60 plus FPS on average, and I'm talking about high demanding games on high to ultra settings, but you have to be aware that it has 12 gigs of VRAM, which means that if your favorite games require more than 12 gigs of VRAM on your favorite settings, then you are going to be struggling. But if the games that you play do not require more than 12 gigs of VRAM, the 5070 will be the cheapest graphics card that I would recommend you buying if you have a 4K monitor. I mean, the level of performance is really good and averaging over 60 FPS high to ultra settings in high demanding game is a really good number. But again, be aware of the 12 gigs of VRAM, especially if you play those high demanding titles. If you play games like Fortnite, Valorant or CS2, you can expect well over 240 plus FPS, possibly more depending on the CPU that you have. Now, if you have more money to spend and you want more of a mid-range graphics card for 4K resolution and you need more VRAM, then I recommend you getting the RX 9070 from AMD. This graphics card is very similar compared to the RTX 5070 when it comes to gaming performance. Well, it's actually a bit faster, but the main thing here is that it comes with 16 gigs of VRAM, so you're not going to be running out of VRAM in high demanding games, high to ultra settings for the most part. Also, AMD is much more improved when it comes to ray tracing performance and the upscaling technology in FSR. So if you want to play with FSR enabled or you want to play with ray tracing enabled, then RAID news. When it comes to the exact level of gaming performance, well, you can expect around 65 plus FPS when it comes to 4K high demanding games on high to ultra settings. So very fast level of gaming performance at 4K and it's definitely not the most expensive graphics card out there, especially when you compare it to others in this overpriced market. The price for this graphics card by the time of filming is around 680 bucks and if you can find it at its MSRP you will find it for much much less. So it depends on when you're watching this video but remember that if you want to check the latest pricing and availability in your region well you will have the links down in the video description. If you want an upper mid-range graphics card and in my opinion the best value graphics card in this video I recommend you getting the RTX 5070 Ti or the RX 9070 XT depending on the price. As of right now, both have the same price, so in that case, I recommend you getting the 5070 Ti because it's the better graphics card overall. You will be able to play at 4K to ultra settings at over 80 FPS on average, and I'm talking about high demanding titles. And the 9070 is just slightly slower, but you have to consider that if both are at the same price, with the 5070 Ti, you get slightly faster gaming performance, a better upscaler in DLSS, and a better level of ray tracing performance. Both of these have 16 gigs of VRAM 
so you're not going to be running out of VRAM in high demanding titles and overall amazing GPUs when it comes to 4K or 1440p max settings. The reason why these are the best value as of right now is because the pricing is around 900 USD which is very expensive but compared to the next two graphics cards that I'm about to mention in this well overpriced market this is going to be the sweet spot as of right now. I expect prices to continue falling but if you want a graphics card right now because you do not want to wait I completely understand that and the 5070 Ti is going to be your best option at this moment. Then if you want a high-end GPU for 4K, I recommend you getting the RTX 5080. Now the RTX 5080 is a 4K ultra graphics card. You will be able to average over 90 FPS and it's a beast of a graphics card overall, not only for gaming but also for content creation and streaming. So in my opinion, it's the second or third best graphics card in the entire market. You will be able to play any game that you want at 4K without any issues. The only issue with this graphics card is that the price as of right now is almost 1500 USD which is very very expensive and to be fair, the 5070 Ti, even though it's not as fast, is not that much slower and is much cheaper. I mean, the price difference is around 600 USD. So if you are looking for better value, go with the 5070 Ti. But if you have plenty of money to spend on your new gaming PC, then the RTX 5080 might be your best option. And if you have even more money and you just want the best graphics card available, so you want the highest frame rates, then I recommend you getting the RTX 5090, which is the best and most expensive graphics graphics card in the entire market going for over 3700 USD so very 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 expensive but the level of performance is of course top tier you get the fastest GPU in the market and you will be able to average well over 130 FPS when it comes to high to ultra settings in high demanding titles so by far the fastest GPU and if you don't care about money you just want the best of the best this is the graphics card that i recommend you buying and the price a few weeks ago was around 6000 usd so it might continue to fall i recommend you checking the links down in the video description for the latest prices and availability and if you need a more personal pc help and you want me to help you out with your next pc whether it's a pre-built pc or a pc build i recommend you checking the first link in the description that's going to be my personal pc help thank you for watching and i will see you on the next one